They got me a new car. I got a new fishing boat. All I had, you know, I can't, I'm just a taxi driver. I just went along with it because it's the guys, you know, up on top are pulling these strings. This was all Photoshop fake the day before 9-11 and then used on 9-11 on most of the major yellow, yellow journalism media to make you think this was a real taxi guy and he stopped on the freeway and the, he saw the planes clip the light poles and the light poles supposedly hit his windshield. But when you look at the front of his car, not a dent. If the, if the light pole crashed in to his windshield, it would have bounced and at least scratched the paint. Not a scratch. This thing was so wired. And you won't hear about this documentary, the Pentagon, and these guys. And these are just two young citizens that went out and did their interview. Now, I want to report to you a little bit about the uh, Catherine Jackson and Michael Jackson's three kids who are suing AEG Live Tour Company, the second largest tour company in the Hollywood business that does this sort of thing. A lot of the fans have started making their own support Katherine Jackson t-shirts. This particular one shows Michael. This was given to me by Italians in Italy. Michael at Neverland. Michael Jackson was royally screwed by Judge Melville, which means bad village. Judge Melville allowed 10 fabricated, 10 fabricated faked evidence things to be brought against Michael in 2005. And it was all proven to be rubbish. Faked evidence, fabricated felonies. All proven. That's why the all-white jury found this very good, saintly, singing, dancing saint Michael Jackson 100% innocent. Now, with that, I want to mention... We're going to close out. I'm going to say goodbye.